Hey everyone, welcome back to another video here today. Today we're taking a look at Black Adam on 4K Ultra HD. Now this is a movie I did not see in theaters. I really wanted to though, but I did watch it later on on Max. And now I have the 4K. Not the best movie. There's definitely plenty of other DCEU and DC movies that are better than this one. But for what it was... It wasn't that bad. I don't think this is a movie I'll revisit a ton, though. But I do think it looked visually very nice. So this uh, should be, hopefully, a nice 4K disc. Now, they do have the uh, WB100 sticker there. With some of the other releases they've been putting, like, WB100 years up on the top left of the slipcover. Here, it's just a sticker, though. Good cover, though. The Blu-ray is a bit more crowded. They have all the Justice Society characters on it. But on this, it's just Black Adams. Looks good. 4K, Blu-ray, and digital code. Here's a look at the spine. Pretty simple. Same on that side as well. And here is the back. Very colorful. Kind of glossy as well. So we do have Black Adam, of course. And we have the four members of the Justice Society. Definitely uh, some uh, good characters. Well portrayed as well. I would love to uh, especially see Hawkman again in a DCU movie. I don't know, but uh, hopefully. It'd be nice. But yeah, that is the back there. Got some yellow writing down there. Looks good. Let's go ahead and take the slip cover off, though. And we will take off the plastic wrap as well. There we are. Here is the cover. And the spine. Of course, the lettering is a bit smaller. And here is the back again. Let's go ahead and open it up. So here are the discs. We have Black Adam, 4K, kind of a tan brown disc there. But here is this disc, and it's yellow. So that is a very interesting to see a yellow disc. You don't see that too often. I know, I think one of my Fast and Furious discs is yellow, but uh, you don't see a yellow disc often. That's kind of hard to get under that one there. Digital code as well. I'll have to redeem that one. But, you know, nothing uh, too crazy with this release. It's a standard DC release. But um, I do have a lot of the other DC movies. I'm building up my DCEU collection. So even though they're kind of shutting down the DCEU and starting fresh, which I think is the right call, I did want to add this to the collection. I do have... Kind of the other related films as well. I have Shazam and then Shazam 2, Fury of the Gods. Now, Black Adam is a Shazam villain, but Shazam is not in the Black Adam movie, which was a bit of a misstep in my opinion. But there it is, kind of the unofficial Shazam Black Adam trilogy. They all are nice 4K releases. They all have the Blu-ray and digital code and... That's the WB-100 I was talking about, but for now, we're just focusing on Black Adam. It's a good release. Happy to add it to the collection. There is kind of a weird line there. I feel like maybe a box cutter got into that or something, just very slightly. I don't really know, though. But, decent movie. We won't be seeing Black Adam again, though, at least by Dwayne Johnson. But uh, for what this movie is, it's okay. I'd say check it out if you haven't already. For now, that's going to wrap up this video. Thanks a lot for watching, and stay tuned for more.